Hello everyone, Mr Harris here. I hope you've had an enjoyable but safe weekend. It's nice to see the sun again. Not sure how long this will last, but it is nice to be able to sit outside uh, when the opportunity comes. As you know, some of our schools have started to extend their offer in a very slow and steady pace. And over the coming week, we will let you know more about if these are to be extended or all of our schools will start to offer extended provision from the 15th of June. We're still checking, we're still assessing risk, we're still looking at all of the information and we will continue to look at how we think it's best for us to move forward to extend our offer. But as I've always said, this is a partnership and you may feel comfortable in sending your children but you may not and that's fine at this time I think it's fine for you if you decide that you don't think it's safe enough to send your child that you can keep them at home for those groups that have been extended to I'd also like to thank you for all the hard work you your children doing in learning at home and for those groups that will continue to learn at home over the foreseeable future we are going to continue providing you with the information and the opportunities for you to access that. And we hope that you continue to let us know if you've had problems or also share the amazing work that's being done, not just in our schools, but also by you at home. So I look forward to seeing all of that. I look forward to working together with you all in partnership, be that by coming into school for the years that are open or for working at home with your children. Keeping in contact, making sure we celebrate what we're doing. As I've always said, I'm immensely proud to be in such a diverse and multicultural community, but seeing how people are coming together at this very difficult time is truly an inspiration. So as we go through this week, we will be sending more information about what might be happening next week. That will come from your schools and it will inform you of how people are to come into buildings and also how people are to leave, how to, what our expectations will be, or if we can or cannot extend our offers. And that information will come to you from the schools via the study books or the communication systems they have, our apps and our our web pages and I really ask you to keep checking those pages to get the information that you need and also from next week there'll be a change for those year groups that have been extended to where the children are provided their dinners in school which means that the vouchers we've been providing for those identified year groups will as of next week be stopping because we're providing the lunches in school if you are having problems, however, you need to contact the school and let them know of your issues and they will see what they can do best to meet your needs as we move forward. We are here together, working together, and I want to look at the best ways we can do that. And I know we've done that over the many, many weeks we've been doing this. The other thing I ask, again, is you work with your children on the idea of their personal space. Making sure that they keep a space around themselves. This is going to be important, not just at school, but in life in general as we move forward. Also, really, really focusing on washing those hands and good hygiene practices. Catching that sneeze, binning the tissue, making sure we wash our hands as much as possible. All of these things will be essential as we move forward in this time of dealing with COVID-19 and also getting back into schools. It is, as always, an immense honour and privilege to be working with you and in our community. And I just want to thank you again for all of your understanding and support. I know it's difficult. I know at times you must be frustrated, but we are trying our best and will try our best 
and want to work with everyone to move forward. I hope you have a fantastic week and we will be sending more information later in the week. Look after yourselves, keep doing the work as much as possible and I hope to see you all in the near future.